Okay, um, first let's see what this is going to look like. Now, these are actually called trans swipes, and most of them, uh, they're in all of the t t toolkits. Um, I think they appeared mostly in the pros. Uh, just to show you. I'm assuming this is what you meant. These things. Um, so let me just show you what they look like. I already have my video. Now this is how the layout is in Sony Vegas. But I have 64-bit um, version 10D. So let's see. So you can see how that works. It's just like a swipe, except it uses a mat instead of an actual um, animation. So let's go ahead and show you how I did that. The first thing we're going to do is create um, four video tracks. And what, what we're going to need is going to go to track one, and this is where we're going to place our media, our transwipe. And then we're going to take our A roll, place it directly beneath, and our B roll directly beneath that. Um, I don't need the sound, so I'm just going to delete that. Now, the first thing you're going to need to know is where you want the um, A and B rolls to transition. Both these footages are exactly the same. They have, they're just still footage. So I'm just going to have it start in around 5 seconds. And, I'm sorry, you need to take this down to track 4. Um, also, what you, what you need to do, remember the trans swipe is on track 1, A roll is on track 2, track 3 is blank, and then you have track 4, which is our B roll. The first thing I need to do is, is duplicate this. Now you can, the easy way to do that is just click this and hit duplicate track and that will do it automatically or you can just simply click the video press the control key and then dra and then drag it down and it accomplishes the same thing so you're going to need a clip from a roll that's the exact same length of the trans swipe so you accomplish that by selecting it and hitting um, the split key at the beginning both for the top and the bottom tracks you're going to delete the first portion of track 2 and the latter portion of track 3 you're going to shrink this so it matches the exact length of track uh, of the trans swipe now since depending on your project the trans swipe won't be the exact size. So in this case, I'm going to hit event pan and crop, right click, and match aspect ratio. Now, let's after we've now we've done all this, let's go to track one and hit the track effects button. We're going to select Sony mask generator add ok then we're going to select the make sure the luminous is selected and then we're going to take the compositing mode and select it as multiply mask you see it goes black now for track 2 we select the com make, com make compositing child for the child to track 1 Track 3 remains apparent. 
this is just the lead roll that will go into this transition through the transition wipe showing the bottom of transition, transition B and then it will continue to play out. Let's shorten this so that we can see this. Now let's scroll through to see how it works out. Okay now let's do a RAM preview to see what our Trans wipe will look like. And I have added a sound effect down here and timed it to the animation. You can see the background's transitioning there. Yeah, pause this for a second, actually. Okay, let's just see what this looks like. We get Darth Vader and Black RT2. And there we go.